Oh, this is Lee's fan. Okay, first of all, you guys must know that this is another closure that Ed even hadn't seen yet. I've only seen it once before. It's called a Zork. And it comes like this, and you it's a it's a mushroom cap, and you unpeel this ribbon, and you've got a full-on molded rubber cap. And the New Zealand, I, I've only seen an Australian wines, and here's a California wine called Lee's Fitch Cabernet. This, I thought this was extraordinary. Well, you know, I, the pedigree is amazing because this is like the great grandson of August Sebastiani, who founded Sebastiani Vineyards in, in Sonoma in the turn of the last century. Uh, so there's obviously some pedigree here. Um, mm. And they, uh, you know, they're making some incredible wines. They put it in a clear glass, which is kind of interesting, but this is 2011. It's, it's a readily available wine in some areas, but I just thought the Cabernet character, it's not trying to be too much. No. It's not overly simple either. It's got some, it's got some layers in there. Wonderful spicy component. It really does have a nice That's little it. spice component in there, and, and a nice rich kind of almost blackberry a component that you don't normally get out of Cabernet. Mm -hmm. It's got some really sweet smelling vanilla oak in there, you know, but it's not overbearing. It's funny, I wrestled with this wine when I tasted it the first time and I made him bring it back. <laughs> who, who won? Took him down. <laughs> wrestled with it. Broke the bottle everywhere. And, yeah. and, but then he brought the second bottle back and I go, wow, this is really good. I don't know what my problem was. So when the wine landed here, you, I wow. made sure I tasted all the samples from mm -hmm. different palates and it was just as good all over. I, just really, oh, this is a 95 for me. I'm I'm doing a ninety five too. Twelve ninety nine on the shelf, seven ninety nine on the reorder price. That I think it is talks about Sebastiani Plaza here. Well well Lee's Fitch is actually a building in Sonoma that's a historical landmark. Ah, and it's in the Sonoma County. It's in that Sonoma Plaza where the Sebastiani Theater is. Right.